This video is made possible thanks to the pump station and nurturery. Come visit us at 2727 Main Street in Santa Monica, California. You can also visit our website, pumpstation.com. This is Adam, the certified car seat technician with Infant Toddler Youth and the Pump Station and Nurturery. And in today's video, we're going to show you how to adjust the shoulder straps as your child gets taller. If you look on the back of the car seat, you're going to see there are three different height positions that the straps can possibly be at for your child. Now, when you purchase the car seat, it's going to be at the lowest level for a newborn. So as they get taller, you are going to have to move them up accordingly. And the way to know when it's time to move up is you want to see where the child's shoulder is. Once their shoulder reaches level two, you're going to move it to level two. Once their shoulder reaches level three, you're going to move it to level three. So don't move the straps up until their shoulder actually reaches that slot. Because the way the car seats are supposed to be adjusted is that the strap should be coming at or below their shoulder, so it's coming up and over. Now when you're ready to move it up, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is loosen the harness. So hold the button, pull the strap away from the car seat, and get everything nice and snug. You're then gonna turn the car seat around, and on the back of the car seat, you're gonna see there's three different height positions. And right now the straps are coming out from level one. If you follow the shoulder straps, you're gonna see they're connected to this metal clip. You wanna disconnect them one at a time. You're then gonna pull it out from the front and you're gonna feed it to the next level. And the reason why you want to do this one at a time is you want to make sure that you're reconnecting it properly. The strap should not be going over the bar. It should not be twisted or tangled. And you need to make sure that you reconnect it correctly so it doesn't come undone on its own. So we matched it up with the other one so we know it's on there properly. And now we can go ahead and do the second one. There we go. Reconnect. Both sides are now done. If you want to make sure nothing is getting stuck, just loosen and tighten a couple of times here to make sure the harnesses are still working as intended. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to follow the Pump Station and Nurturery on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. All the details will be in the description below. See you in the next video.